A fine specimen of a tree behind. We are in Beverly. You can pause that if you want to read it. Just finding the entrance to the church. Here we are at St. Mary's Church, Beverly. It's a really beautiful church, actually. Look forward to showing you inside. It's quite scary. It's quite old in here, isn't it? Nice changing room. There's a dog in here. Hello. Hi. Thank you for sharing our changing room. We've never had a dog in a changing room before, have we, Jonathan? No. Right, we we'll better get changed. Very, very smart. And uh, just checking on the. Oh, I'm late. I'm not late. It's not what I think. What do you think about this? Okay. Look okay. I think so. I think you should make sure it's in the middle. Yeah. So yeah, you just need to go to the right a bit, Jonathan. That way. Yeah. Stop. I've just got an eye for these things. Hello, here we are. We're at the Bridgewater Hall. Isn't it fantastic to be back here? Um, it's a very special day today because we're celebrating Jonathan's 10th anniversary of his concert series. And uh, it's going to sound very nice, isn't it? Um, here's the organ. <laughs> Jonathan just doing some final checks. Jonathan, it's an exciting day, isn't it? See if it's plugged in. See if it's plugged in. That's a good idea. Oh, there you go. It's happened. On the top that kills the sound. The back one. You seem to know what you're doing. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. We're doing a bit of organ tuning, not me, but uh, we're just having a listen. Would you like to see inside the Bridgewater Hall organ? I'm sure you would. We're doing the Highland Fling. Jonathan's paying for a wedding today. Let's go into this lovely church here. Oh, so here's the organ. Oh, you play it from over here, though. It's over here. We were at Bridgewater Hall the other day, of course, and uh, David Wood, he was, uh, he was tuning the organ for you, and he looks after the organ. But this is one of his company's organs. Where does it say it? 99, he must have rebuilt it. It would have Huddersfield organ. Fantastic. So, there you go, uh, David. It's nice to, to see this very fine organ. It's lovely. Jonathan, will you play for my wedding when I get married? Of course, what would you like me to play? I thought, I thought you might ask me if uh, I need to find a wife first. That's not going to happen. That's cheeky. Very nice. What do you think about this organ, Jonathan? Very nice. Yeah, let's go and have a look around the back. 
Okay, well, let's, let's go and do that section. We should let's have a quick look. Okay, that's that. Behind the scenes. Is that the new front end? Really nicely painted. And there's just a few nice things up there. And this uh, cross is from actually from Reims Cathedral, where I believe Gryson was the organist, yeah? A little bit of something about it here. Isn't that interesting? Lovely. So Jonathan, you ready for the for the big play moment? Play for weddings. Play for weddings. <laughs> you don't often play for many weddings, do you, Jonathan? I try not to. I try not to. <laughs> What's it like? Bells are going off. I should go and, I should go and record the bells. I'm going to get the bell sound. I'm going to make a video of this big wedding, so it's nice. Bells. Join us at a dramatic moment as Jonathan is playing in a reception for the wedding. Very nice, Jonathan. Behind me, the Derbyshire countryside. Here we are, we're in New Mills, we've got a piano duet concert. Jonathan. You brought can I still to today's concert? I need something to sit on. I need something to sit on, of course. Good thinking. Hi, looking forward to it. Coming oh, back well, later. Thank you. Yeah, we'll look forward to seeing you there. Yeah. Concert poster. Jonathan with can I still going into the venue. I had a picture from last time we were here. I don't remember where to put the projector and screen. That's, that's very organised for me, isn't it? It's wonderful to be back here at Springbank Arts. Uh, a lot of people did ask me how they get to Springbank Arts Centre, and I did tell them, practice. <laughs> <laughs> that joke also works at Carnegie Hall, I believe. Anyway, so... So here we are, we're in Grappenhall. Grappenhall, which is in uh, Cheshire. So, we shall have a look at the church. St. Wilford's Church. And the church is open. A beautiful church. There seems to be small mice everywhere. No idea why. Jonathan is just preparing to venture down the hole where his organ is based. Well, it's hard to get onto the bench. Is it? Do you have to like jump onto it? Okay, we'll watch this procedure now. I think it's doing well. Yeah, that's good. No. That, that works. Ow. Ow. You look coming with lots of bruises. A, oh, a, can get on this a perfect um, bench manoeuvre. Top manual over there. Well, there's a swell box for some of it. That's nice. Not a lot. Is that enough of a demonstration? There's more mice. There's another mouse over here. What's that? Everywhere I look, there's knitted mice. A mouse mystery. Just uh, do a bit of rehearsing. Jonathan has fixed the squeak. 
just halfway through our rehearsal. Jonathan, how are you doing down this hole? You're still having fun? It's very quiet. You, you, you must be blocking all the sound. Pardon? Yeah. For Hawkins and Son. Is this the first Hawkins and Son argument we've ever featured on the channel? That, that sundial's not working. <laughs> on account of the rain. I need to take a picture of the Cheshire Cat. Apparently this is the Cheshire Cat. Inspiring the works of Lewis Carroll. He actually only lived 50 miles away from here. And on the front of the church is, I'm looking up there, I'll show you, is, is a cat. Apparently it is the Cheshire Cat. I might just take a picture of it so you can see it. I'll take a picture. I've taken a picture so you'll, I can zoom in on that and show you the Cheshire Cat of Cheshire. The real Cheshire Cat, isn't that exciting? Not really been that exciting today, has it so far? We've done a little rehearsal. There was a squeak on the piano. The squeak is gone and I showed you a Cheshire Cat. So that is basically today. And I, I, we're going to have a little listen to the concert. Sound of the Seagull. Here we are, Queen Street Methodist Central. Oh, we'll have a piano and organ concert. I'll just see if the door's open. The door is open. We're in. Jonathan, how are you getting on? I've set the screens up. This is quite a big instrument, really, isn't it? It's very loud. <laughs> it's very loud. Actually, it's got a special so, um, surprise, this organ, hasn't it? It's got lots of special surprise. It's Pittman and Haley. Did you get that? Put it on the screen. It, it's an all pneumatic action. Mm. Two enclosed boxes. Uh, the action's been replaced. It's had a little bit of uh, messing about slightly. Um, basically, all these sort of very nice, all these time sort of sound. The, the swell is massive, though, because yep. that's just the swell on its. Once you get onto the grate, so you've got this huge, and the pedal is. This sort of we want to see the, the surprise. The surprise. So this is the this. Yes. The we like an organ with a celeste. You have the octaves on it. Three knocks all the stops in. And on the top manual, four knocks all the stops in. And on there the you go. Manual, surprise feature. So when they can't reset them, and it looks like I'm about to. Uh, that is going a to the few. It's oh, a serious button. Uh, what did that do? Don't it's, press it. Don't press it. <laughs> this, is, this is a light, actually. It's a very big hall. It's it's a lovely hall, a lovely space to perform piano and organ duos in. See, it, we're just looking at if Jonathan can actually see me. I'll, I'll sit down and you can see if you can see me. I can see you. We can all see Jonathan. And give him a wave. Yeah, yeah, that's nice. That's good. Well, there you go. We should have a little rehearsal. I'm here on the piano. Jonathan's on the organ. Lots of great sounds. Let's rehearse, Jonathan. quite well actually the piano is very old uh, I can't actually get my legs underneath it the sound of the seagulls <laughs> we finished the rehearsal we've set up for the concert <clears throat> now we're gonna go and see the sea technically we could go to the fair that's a famous fair I believe in Doesn't Scarborough I've seen anything yet have you seen been all down, seagulls <clears throat> you just it's a little path down the left isn't there yeah, that's what I thought finding the finding, sea finding the sea is that the fair? No, it's just the wheel. Scarborough has quite a famous hotel, which is called the uh, Grand Hotel. And actually, when it was built, it was the largest hotel and brick building in Europe. There you go. Fact. Fact. And it's here. It's in a V shape. 
and they said that it was in a V shape because it was for it was like the good. Queen, <laughs> Queen Victoria. But I think it's just so that it distributes the weight. Engineering fact for you, because it's on a cliff. Anyway, here it is, the majestic Grand Hotel Scarborough. There's the tramway. Tramway to the beach. I feel very welcome now, now I've read that. The writer Anne Bronte was actually, um, she, well it's on the site of the hotel, she actually, she died there. And he's buried just at the Church of the Road, isn't it? Where's the grave, John? There you go. Thank you for that. And there it is, the Grand Hotel. I, I hope you enjoyed that little, very short tour of Scarborough, but at least we went to see the sea. We heard the seagulls, we saw the Grand Hotel, the Statue of Queen Victoria, a Ferris wheel, that was super sea. That's about it. Hello, and here we are. We're back home, and uh, we've been to some interesting places. Some interesting organs and places. Hope you've enjoyed uh, watching where we've been. And uh, yeah, and uh, we love reading your comments. Yeah. Uh, always uh, exciting to read what you think of where we've been. And uh, we're just on a trip up the road now. Yes, because every time somebody buys a CD from us, we go up the road and post it. So it we gives just, us a bit of exercise. We do, oh, there's a tree, hang on, let me do um, Which means that every, the more, more things you order, uh, the more exercise Jonathan gets. Or Tom. Or me, because we do take it in turns. So, fantastic. So we look forward to sharing our musical journey with where you. Where are we going next, Tom? Where are we going next? Well, I, I could leave a clue of where we're going next. Okay, okay I'll do I that. I could do it knowing as well. Okay, well, I'll let you know. You can work out the clue. <laughs> and, or if you work out the clue, let us know where you think we're going. Um, fantastic stuff. So, thank you for watching, and we'll see you again very soon.